Hello, and welcome to PC Talk. Today, on this holiday special edition, we have Dr. Joe Dennis, a professor of mass communications here at Piedmont College. Thanks for being with us, Joe. No problem. Thanks for having me, Ben. Of course. So can you start us off by telling us a little bit about yourself? Sure. Um, I've been at Piedmont now for about a year, loving it. Prior to that, I taught a little bit at UGA, and I did some newspaper writing. I was an editor of a local newspaper, did some radio, did a little bit of everything. Um, originally from Chicago, but I've been in Georgia now for 16 years, so I consider myself a native. Sounds exciting. So believe it or not, we're already in November, and the holiday season is just around the corner. So what do you have planned for this holiday season? Yeah, I can't believe how quickly it snuck up on us. Um, Thanksgiving, we kind of have a tradition with uh, another family. We live in Athens, um, another family that's from out of town, and we call them our Georgia family. And so we've always spent Thanksgiving together, and this year we have a brand new house, so we're looking forward to hosting them. Christmas, we have a tradition as well, where we go back up to Chicago for a couple weeks and spend some time there. Sounds great. So. Uh... What is your th favorite Thanksgiving dish to eat? You know, it's probably the two least sexy dishes, but <laughs> stuffing and cranberry sauce. And I don't know why, because those are two dishes that you can get any time, mm -hmm. <laughs> but I only ever eat them on Thanksgiving, and I love them, and I don't know why I don't just buy them year-round. But <laughs> Yeah, stuffing's always been my favorite as well. Mm -hmm. so, uh, do you have any memory, like what, what is your favorite Christmas gift that you've received? Ooh, when I was a kid, it was definitely a uh, Dukes of Hazard car, the General Lee. Mm -hmm. Familiar with that? It was, I was a huge fan of that show growing up. Um, even, I, even though I was a Yankee from Chicago, we watched the Dukes of Hazard. And one Christmas, I got the General Lee car and little Bo and Luke Duke. And I remember opening that gift and just playing with it all Christmas Day. How old do you think you were when you got that? Oh, probably six or seven years old. It could be a collector's item by now. Yeah, I don't think my mom probably threw it out. <laughs> <laughs> True. So uh, at what point do you think it's appropriate to start decorating for Christmas? Definitely after Thanksgiving. I think you got to let each holiday come and go. And yeah, we make that kind of our tradition, not the Friday after Thanksgiving. Well, we don't do the shopping, but we definitely decorate the house then. Mm -hmm. So when do you start Christmas shopping for your kids? You know, thankfully that's something my wife does because it would drive me crazy to do that. Um, but she usually has a big shopping trip with a friend of hers and they usually go not the weekend of Thanksgiving but the next weekend after. Okay. Um, and do you, do you have any like uh, general Santa Claus traditions that you hold <laughs> up in your house? Well, when I was growing up, I grew up Catholic in a Catholic family, and we always went to midnight mass. And so I remember the tradition growing up was Santa would come um, to the house while we were at midnight mass. So it was a heck of a way to get a little kid to want to go to church. And then we'd come back, and it'd be one in the morning, and there were all the gifts. And so that was a fun, fun thing to experience. But for our kids, since we're always in Chicago with, with grandmas and grandpas, um, Santa makes a visit to us there, and they wake up in the morning and get to open up all their Christmas toys. It's always a great feeling. Mm -hmm. so, now that we've heard a bit about how Professor Davis, uh, so sorry. That's okay. <laughs> so now that we've heard about a little bit about how you celebrate Christmas at your house, let's hear how some other Piedmont students celebrate Christmas and some of their favorite holiday memories. About ten, um, my parents like hid my two big presents, I got an Xbox and a TV, and they hit them until like an hour after everybody got done opening their gifts. And uh, then they like brought them out, and it was just like a big surprise. We would always get oatmeal um, and sprinkle it outside our carport for the reindeers. And I would always write a letter to Santa and then make him cookies with my mom, so. Uh, my older brother, myself, we always had a competition who could stay up the longest throughout the night. And so I always won because I always drank a lot of coffee. The best gift I ever received was a Ninja Turtles tractor toy with pizza wheels on it. I must have been three years old. Might still have it somewhere, actually. Those are all such great stories. 
And I want to thank you so much for joining us in the studio today. Of course. And I want to thank you for watching this special holiday episode of PC Talk. I've been your host, Ben Thornburg, and have a happy holiday.